Welcome to Hair Fairies, a salon that specializes in ridding its patrons of head lice. Many who come here have already spent countless hours trying to exterminate these unwanted guests. Hair Fairies is part of a national trend towards salons that specialize in head lice removal. On any given day here, the salon is packed with children and adults. In fact, a thousand families a month visit Hair Fairy salons in San Francisco, Los Angeles, Chicago, and New York. My name is Therese Tatum, and I was in LA visiting the family for the holidays and was trying to avoid my nieces who had lice and they had been had to stay home from school because of it. And I ended up somehow getting it from them and then tried absolutely everything to get rid of it. I tried mayonnaise, I tried um, olive oil with tea tree oil and lavender and neem oil, Vaseline. <laughs> My daughter went to a birthday party, she's 15, and an hour into the birthday party she called me and she said, everybody has head lice at this party. People become frantic when they get head lice, so you're kind of calming them down and nurturing them. Every client comes three times, it's within, within a week and a half. Our guarantee is good for 14 days. So whether you have, whether you get lice again or you don't, you can come back every day for free if you'd like. There's so many misconceptions about lice and how they travel, that they can jump, they can fly, they can go across the universe, and that it is that easily contracted, but, but it's by head-to-head -head contact. So they cannot jump, they cannot fly, or anything of that nature. And the nits are actually the eggs that are laid by um, the louse. The nits vary in color. They are always going to be the same shape and size. They're going to go from a translucent color to almost black before they actually hatch. What we consider um, severe is 25 nits or three bugs. Even with two nits, those can become two bugs that then within um, 30 days, which is their lifespan, um, will lay another 150 nits, which will become another 150 bugs. So it's very important to have everything out of the hair. The biggest misconception about head lice is that they discriminate. Head lice is not a dirty person's problem. You know, it's everyone's problem. It takes a village to get rid of head lice. I know it carries a negative stigma, but it really is something that the more open we are about it, the, the, the better we'll be at getting rid of it. It's like a good therapy session when you have no lice. <laughs> <laughs> and my friend, you have no lice, so <laughs> yay!